habitat loss, pollution, hunting, and competition for food or habitat are all primary threats to all creatures on Earth. Like Human activities have a much greater impact on the survival of currently endangered species than ever before. Join us as we look at 20 last unknown photos of animals that went extinct. 20. Thylacine The Tasmanian tiger, a marsupial that resembled a mix of a big cat, a fox, and a wolf, is believed to have died out in 1936. However, eight sightings of Tasmanian tigers have been recorded in the last three years, according to a document recently released by the Tasmanian government. The most recent news came when a man in Hobart, Tasmania, discovered what seemed to be a Tasmanian tiger footprint. Kangaroos, wombats, and sheep were all eaten by Tasmanian tigers. In the 19th century, British settlers in Tasmania hunted them to extinction. The last Tasmanian tiger died in captivity in Hobart's Bomaris Zoo on September 7, 1936. At least, that is what was thought. The Department of Primary Industries, Parks, Water, and Environment in Tasmania published a document that confirmed Australian people have been witnessing Tasmanian tiger sightings. There have been eight confirmed sightings in the last two years. It was easily identified by its yellow-brown fur and a pattern of black stripes running down the lower back and tail, hence the tiger moniker. Because Tasmanian tigers preyed on kangaroos, wombats, and, on rare occasions, sheep and goats, it put them at odds with British colonists who arrived in Tasmania in 1803. The last wild Tasmanian tiger was believed to have been hunted to extinction 130 years later. Owing to their resemblance to dogs, coyotes, and wolves, the animals are also known as Tasmanian wolves. The Tasmanian tiger lived for 4 million years in Australia, Tasmania, and Papua New Guinea before becoming extinct. But sightings confirmed by people like this couple near Corinna, Tasmania, claiming they were 100% positive they saw a Tasmanian tiger, maintain hope that the tiger is back. The animal had a thick tail that was rigid and firm at the base. Hundreds and hundreds of times, people have gone to see where a sighting story was and found nothing, but it does not mean it isn't true. The Booth Richardson Tiger Team made headlines in September 2017 when they released video clips and still photos of a creature's blurry snout. Trail cameras were used to record the footage in the Tasmanian wilderness. During a press conference following the release of the images, they said they believed 100% it was a Tasmanian tiger. Some people remained skeptical. There was great enthusiasm at first, but experts speculated that the animal had a one in three chance of being a Tasmanian tiger. 19. Quagga the quagga was a zebra subspecies that existed until the late 19th century. Because they had a distinct stripe pattern in comparison to other zebras, their skins were highly sought after by humans. All zebras were once referred to as quaggas. Previously, quaggas were classified as a separate species. Scientists discovered that the now extinct quaggas were a subspecies of plain zebra after examining their DNA. People wanted to preserve the vegetation quaggas fed on for domesticated livestock because they were valuable for their meat and hides. Furthermore, Few people recognized that the quagga was unique among zebras and required protection. Because the quagga was discovered to be a color variant of the plains zebra, it was thought that the quagga could be reintroduced through selective breeding. The idea was that animals would be chosen based on aspects of their coat color and striping patterns that resembled those of the quagga. 18. Tarpan the tarpan was a type of prehistoric wild horse that roamed from southern France and northern Spain east to central Russia. Tarpans became extinct in the wild between 1875 and 1890, and the last known wild mare was accidentally killed in Russia while being captured. Tarpin, the last captive tarpin, died in a Ukrainian zoo in 1909. This tarpin clone is also known as the Konik Polski. This breed arose from tarpin recreation projects in Poland. This Polish Konik has been successfully released into nature reserves in some countries, including the Netherlands, since its inception some 30 years ago. These horses were then transported to Latvia, Bulgaria, and other European countries. 17. Seychelles Giant Tortoise Commonly known as the Seychelles Domed Giant Tortoise, was a subspecies of the genus Aldebracalis. It lived on the main central Granitic Seychelles Islands, but was hunted in huge numbers by European sailors. By roughly 1840, it was thought to be extinct, along with Arnold's gigantic tortoise, a subspecies that shared the same islands. It was recently discovered. There are currently a bit more than a hundred individuals. Many have re-established themselves in the wild on forested islands like Silhouette, before being evicted by the Seychelles Islands Development Company in 2011. Giant tortoises are some of the world's longest living animals. 
animals. Some Aldabra giant tortoises are thought to be over 200 years old. The island's development company's intention to evict the Nature Protection Trust of Seychelles from Silhouette Island by March 2011, along with its refusal to allow wild tortoises to reside on the island, forced them to remove and relocate the tortoises. 16. Barbary Lion Prior to the 18th century, Barbary lions roamed freely throughout the Maghreb region, which included coastal northern Libya and the lion's original range. By the 19th century, Turkish authorities' bounties had contributed to the extinction of countless lions in western North Africa. Lions fared better in Morocco at first because the country was ruled by the Sultan, but continued widespread persecution in the 19th century, isolated the animals in separate remote areas in Morocco, Algeria, and Tunisia. Tunisia's last lion was killed in 1891. A lioness killed much later, in 1942, in Morocco's high Atlas Mountains, was thought to be the last seen in the wild. Small populations, however, appear to have persisted in Algeria and Morocco for years, with sporadic sightings dating back to the 1960s. The Barbary lion is thought to have died because of military conflict in 1958, when the forests north of Satif were destroyed during the French-Algerian War. 15. Western Black Rhino the International Union for Conservation of Nature, the world's largest conservation network, has officially declared the western black rhinoceros extinct. The western black rhino, an African subspecies of the black rhino, was last seen in 2006. The black rhino species is critically endangered and is expected to become even more so as rhinos are slaughtered across Africa and Asia on the orders of Asian consumers, particularly in Vietnam, where the horn is coveted as a supposed cancer or hangover cure or as a symbol of wealth. If poaching continues at its current rate, overall black and white rhino numbers are expected to decline as natural deaths and poaching mortalities, it is critical that the three other black rhino subspecies and the southern white rhino do not become extinct. 14. Golden Toad The golden toad is an extinct species of true toad that previously thrived in a small, high-altitude habitat of about four square kilometers north of Monteverde, Costa Rica. It was unique to the elfin cloud forest. The Monteverde toad, also known as the Alajuela toad, or the orange toad, is often regarded as the poster child. The International Union for Conservation of Nature declared the golden toad extinct after the last sighting of a solitary male on May 15, 1989. 13. Paradise Parrot the Paradise Parrot was a colorful, medium-sized parrot native to the grassy forests along the Queensland-New South Wales border in eastern Australia. The last living bird was sighted in 1927 after being highly frequent within its relatively small range. Extensive and prolonged searches in the years since have yielded no convincing evidence of it, and it is the only Australian parrot listed as missing and believed extinct. 12. Giant Gharial Gharials are one of the longest species of crocodile, and they can grow up to 20 feet from the tip of their snout to the end of their tail. Scientists have been breeding gharials since 1989 and have sent them to zoos across India and abroad. They have played a lead role in establishing the Gharial Conservation Alliance, now known as the Gharial Ecology Project. Gharials are among the world's rarest reptiles, with their species critically endangered. Their small snouts, which contain sensory cells that help them detect vibrations in the water, are well specialized for hunting. Since the 1930s, the wild gharials Gharial population has fallen dramatically, and it now occupies only 2% of its historical habitat. The population is still threatened by habitat loss because of sand mining and agricultural conversion, fish resource depletion, and harmful fishing practices. The earliest known images of the Gharial are approximately 4,000 years old and were discovered in the Indus Valley. Locals who lived near rivers believed the gharial had mystical and therapeutic abilities, and some of its body parts were utilized to make indigenous medicine. In our thumbnail, we can see what looks like a primitive gharial, if there was such an animal. To me, it looks more like a dinosaur, but with a man sitting next to it, I doubt it's the case. Why don't you let us know your impressions in the comments below? 11. Sicilian Wolf the Sicilian wolf is an extinct subspecies of gray wolf that was unique to Sicily. It was paler than the mainland Italian wolf and similar in size to the current Arabian and extinct Japanese wolves. The subspecies is said to have become extinct because of human persecution in the 1920s, while there have been reports of sightings as late as 1970. It was recognized as a separate subspecies in 2018 after morphological tests of the few remaining mounted specimens in skull. 10. Heath Hen the heath hen is an extinct subspecies of the greater prairie fowl, a big North American bird from the grouse family. It went extinct in 1932. Historically, heath hens existed in the scrubby heathland barrens of coastal North America, stretching from southernmost New Hampshire to northern Virginia. Heath chickens were very common in their natural habitat throughout colonial times. As a result, residents conducted intensive hunting for food. 
the population fell significantly because of heavy hunting pressure and potential habitat degradation. Heath chickens were wiped off the mainland by 1870, possibly as early as the 1840s. 9. Japanese Sea Lion The only way to see a Japanese sea lion is in books, photographs, or on the internet. They no longer exist, which is very unfortunate. There are some museums in Japan that have stuffed versions or skulls of them that you can see. The males weighed close to 1,240 pounds and stood about 8.5 feet tall. They ranged in hue from very light gray to very dark gray. Unfortunately, conservation efforts for the Japanese sea lion arrived too late to save them. In 2007, a massive effort was made to locate any remaining Japanese sea lions. Some researchers believed they had seen some, which was exciting news. They were, however, identified as California sea lions. Some of these species are being considered for relocation into the habitat that the Japanese sea lions once called home. 8. Carolina Parakeet The Carolina Parakeet is an extinct species of small green, neotropical parrots with a bright yellow head, reddish-orange face, and light beak found in the eastern, midwest, and plains states of the United States. It was the sole indigenous parrot in its region and one of only three parrot species native to the United States. Though once common in its area, the last reported sighting in the wild was in 1910. The final known specimen, a male named Incas, died in captivity at the Cincinnati Zoo in 1918. 7. Guam Flying Fox the Guam flying fox, also known as the small Marianas fruit bat, is an extinct megabat species found on Guam in the Marianas Islands of Micronesia. It was verified extinct owing to hunting or habitat changes. It was originally recorded in 1931 when it was seen roosting with the larger and more common Marianas flying fox. The final specimen was a female discovered roosting at Tarag Cliff in March 1967, but it escaped capture. An unverified sighting occurred somewhere in the 1970s, and no more individuals have been reported since. 6. Round Island Burrowing Boa The Round Island Burrowing Boa is an extinct species of snake from the monotypic genus Bulgaria, family Bulgariidae. The species was native to Mauritius and was last observed on Round Island in 1975. There are no recognized subspecies. The overall length of preserved specimens has been recorded to range from 1.77 to 4.59 feet. Its coloration was characterized as light brown with blackish patches dorsally and pink marbled with blackish ventrally. It had a pointed snout, a cylindrical body, and head. The round island burrowing boa's general body shape indicates that it had fossorial inclinations. It was already scarce in 1949 and was last sighted in 1975. The reasons for its demise are habitat loss caused by soil erosion from goat and rabbit overgrazing. 5. Dodo the dodo is an extinct flightless bird that was found only on the Indian Ocean island of Mauritius, located east of Madagascar. The dodo's nearest relative was the extinct and flightless Rodriguez solitaire. The two comprise the Raffini subfamily, a group of extinct flightless birds that belong to the same family as pigeons and doves. The dodo's closest living relative is the Nicobar pigeon. A white dodo was originally assumed to exist on the nearby island of Reunion, but this notion is now believed to be a result of confusion caused by the also extinct Reunion ibis and paintings of white dodos. 4. Crescent Nailtail Wallaby The Crescent Nailtail Wallaby, also known as the Warong, was a tiny mammal that lived in southwestern and central Australia's scrub and forests, feeding on grasses. They were prevalent in western Australia before disappearing in the early 20th century, and they were still seen in the central deserts as late as the 1950s. The pelage was smooth and silky, with an ashen gray coloration accented in part by rufous tones. There were light and dark patches of fur all over the body, moon-like crescents that inspired their names, and lovely stripes on the face. The species was compared to a hare or rabbit in terms of habits, looks, and taste, and weighed approximately 3.5 kilos. The species was extremely timid and would flee to a hollow log if disturbed at their daytime resting places, a small patch of sand cleared near a large shrub or tree. They ran with their short forelimbs awkwardly held toward the chest. This wallaby was common in agricultural parts in Western Australia's southwest until around 1900. It had started to dwindle rapidly by 1908 when the last wallaby was caught in the area. The last known live specimen of this wallaby was taken in a dingo trap on the Nullarbor or plane in 1927 or 1928. 3. Baiji White Dolphin The Baiji White Dolphin is a probably extinct species of freshwater dolphin found in China's Yangtze River system. It is believed to be the first dolphin species 
to become extinct because of human activity. This dolphin, classified as critically endangered, possibly extinct by the IUCN, has not been sighted in 40 years, and multiple surveys of the Yangtze have failed to locate it. In China, the species is known as the Chinese river dolphin, and local fishermen and boatmen revere it as the goddess of protection. The Baiji population dropped dramatically over decades as China industrialized and made extensive use of the river for fishing, transportation, and hydroelectric power. 2. Formosan Clouded Leopard The Formosan Clouded Leopard is Taiwan's native clouded leopard population. Camera trapping investigations conducted in different Taiwanese protected areas between 1997 and 2012 yielded no clouded leopards. In the summer of 2018, two different groups of rangers reported seeing a clouded leopard in Taitung County. One group claimed to have observed one climbing a tree and hunting goats from a ledge. The second group claimed to have seen a Formosan Clouded Leopard sprint past a scooter on the road and climb up a tree. The population is listed as extinct on the IUCN Red List. 1. Ivory-Billed Woodpecker The Ivory-Billed Woodpecker is a potentially extinct woodpecker found in the bottomland hardwood forests and temperate coniferous forests of the southern United States and Cuba. Habitat loss and hunting have drastically reduced numbers to the point where the International Union for Conservation of Nature classifies the species as critically endangered on its red list. The last universally recognized observation of an American ivory-billed woodpecker occurred in Louisiana in 1944, while the final universally accepted sighting of a Cuban ivory-billed woodpecker occurred in 1987, following the bird's recovery there the previous year. Sporadic reports of sightings and other signs of the species' survival have continued since then, but it looks like this bird has vanished from the face of the earth as well. It's always sad to see such beautiful creatures disappear forever, so I obviously do not have a favorite. Which one of these animals will you miss the most? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. Thanks for watching and see you next time.